There is an ongoing beef between rappers Drake, Kendrick Lamar, and J. Cole, who are now being referred to as the big three in hip hop, according to Business Insider. The beef started when Kendrick Lamar dissed Drake and Cole on the track Like That from Future and Metro Boomin's latest album. In his verse, Lamar referenced Drake's song First Person Shooter, which features Cole. Drake and Cole have taken different artistic paths, with Lamar earning critical acclaim and awards like a Pulitzer Prize, while Drake has been more commercially successful. Cole entered the beef after appearing on Drake's First Person Shooter track, which is about the two being the greatest rappers. Rapper J. Cole apologized to Kendrick Lamar during his Dreamville Festival performance for releasing a diss track called Seven Minute Drill that criticized Lamar's career. Cole told the crowd that the diss track was, quote, the lamest ish I ever did in my effing life, and that he felt terrible about it over the past two days. He acknowledged that he was trying to find an angle to, quote, downplay this ninja's catalog and his greatness, but realized that was the wrong approach. Cole then asked the crowd how many of them thought Kendrick Lamar was, quote, one of the greatest MFs to ever touch a effing microphone, to which the crowd cheered in agreement. He said he loves Kendrick just as much as the audience does. Cole went on to say that he doesn't like the idea of rappers beefing just to satisfy fans who want to see blood. He said that kind of disrupts his peace and goes against his true path. Young Miami and JT have been trading shots online, leading to fears among fans that the duo may be on the verge of splitting up. According to Wrap Up, Young Miami called out JT on Twitter, accusing her of sneak dissing and making, quote, two whole songs dissing me. Young Miami claimed JT made these diss tracks on songs like No Bars and Sideways, where the lyrics seem to reference issues between the two artists. JT responded by asking Young Miami which specific songs were about her, to which Young Miami provided the examples. JT then accused Young Miami of attention-seeking and being weird, but always making it seem like JT is the problem. This online feud comes after social media users previously criticized Young Miami for not publicly supporting JT during her recent back and forth with rapper Glorilla. Fans are now concerned that this public dispute between the City Girls members could signal the end of the popular rap duo. Their most recent album, Raw, was met with mixed reviews, adding to the speculation around potential issues within the group. Meek Mill expressed his displeasure with former label mate Wale for taking a photo with Dean Stay Ready, someone Meek is no longer friends with. In a series of intense, now-deleted tweets, Meek accused Wale of never liking him and stated he would treat him like an enemy. He threatened Wale and accused him of betrayal and secret jealousy. Wale responded by suggesting that getting involved in such drama is often pointless, as people in the industry tend to reconcile eventually. Rick Ross has referred to the situation as a misunderstanding. The situation highlights ongoing tensions within the rap community. Legendary rapper Missy Misdemeanor Elliott is embarking on her first ever headlining tour in 2024, titled Out of This World, The Missy Elliott Experience. The tour is set to kick off on July 4th in Vancouver and will include stops in major cities across North America, wrapping up on August 22nd in Rosemont, Illinois. According to Billboard, the tour will feature support from fellow hip-hop icons Busta Rhymes, Sierra, and Missy's longtime collaborator and producer, Timbaland. The tour poster features the artist dressed in futuristic, Mad Max-style leather outfits standing in front of a giant spaceship. The announcement was accompanied by a short teaser video directed by Missy's frequent collaborator Dave Myers. In the clip, the three artists emerge from the spacecraft and encounter some confusion, with Busta getting lost while trying to navigate using a celestial map. Missy then calls Timbaland to complain about Busta's poor sense of direction in space. This tour marks a major milestone for Missy Elliott, as she embarks on her first ever headlining tour over three decades into her storied career. Fans have long clamored for Missy to tour, and she is finally delivering this experience by teaming up with Sierra, Busta, and Timbaland. Be sure to like this video and subscribe or follow. Thanks for watching.